She broke my bunger. Lord Love again, and doing another beat. This beat is gonna be some warped sort of uh, organ type beat, lo-fi again, and it's gonna be filthy, I think. I've got this organ sound. Which sounds cool, uh, but I wanna make it a nice fat chord and just play that at different tones. Uh, and yeah, it's it, you know sometimes you can just do sort of your your basic kind of minor chords, but I want to add some chord extensions there and make it more interesting. And so this is going to be like a minor chord, but it's going to be like this. So you got you know in C, you got a C, you got the fifth, um, and then you're gonna go for the D, E flat. sounds way more kind of um, anxious and interesting I might shift it round a little bit like put one of the like the D maybe an octave higher or something like that but we'll see how that goes so I've added a chord trigger now just so I can kind of just play all the sounds in one like press of the pad uh, rather than having to play all the keys out fully perfectly and sometimes it's better to do that anyway because it just you know it makes it more hip-hop in a way so that's what I've done taken basically those chords and put them at um you know across the keys so uh sounds like this and that sounds warped and irregular and dirty and i bloody love it And look at this, as if by magic I've changed clothes. Oh, how the wonderful world of editing works. Uh, drum sounds now, so we got kick, snare, cheeky ring shot, ring shot, rim shot. Either way, it sounds a bit filthy, doesn't it? Uh, and yeah, cheeky little crash cymbal, and like a closed hi-hat. Check me out changing clothes again for a giggle. Oh, you know I like to keep it fruity. This is like a odd version of Stars in a Rise maybe, except I'm not a star and no one knows me, but here we go. Switched up the drums a little bit, made the drums a little bit more interesting, uh, changed up some of the sounds, got rid of the rim shots, did a different sort of open hi-hat sound, and just gonna probably add an, another like close hi-hat to this, but it sounds like this. Gonna redo them hi hats again because they're a bit sloppy, so need to tighten them up a bit. These drums are sounding well more respectable now. Added a um, reverse hat, hi hat on there as well, just to make the sound more interesting. Uh, some of the like cymbal sounds, the hats need to be turned down a bit. 
I'll do that later, but the main thing was just getting the drums to sound nice and loose and ill. And it's because it's a lo fi hip hop beat, normal thing for me. It's make sure the snares are quantized and on point. Other stuff, when it's this sort of speed, like, you know, 90 BPM, that sort of format, then I don't time to quantize the other drum sounds. I might do a little bit of tidying up, but I, I deliberately don't want them to be on point because I, I want it to sound loose so you get that swing. Um, otherwise it just ends up sounding a bit there and a bit too robotic and we don't want robotic when we're doing this shiz another sub bassy sound here Added another sound to funk it up a little bit, so I kind of call this like a bubble sweep type sound, but it's just. Which is all good, but on top of just having that sound, I've set it up so it pitches up as the filter cut off comes in as well. So the filter cut off slowly cutting the sound off at the same time as it's going up in pitch. It sounds like this. And I might, silence. And I might do that the other way as well and reverse it. And for like a chorus section, I've got the old brass ensemble again, which I like to often use, so. And it's got a chord trigger on it, which is just like a bog standard, like minor seven chord, just to add to it. So let's record that. And I've added this sound which I made a while ago and used a few times, just this kind of uh, synth glide type sound. And it's got a chord trigger on it so it's also playing the fourth note of, um, it's playing two notes, it's playing whatever the um, tonic is and also the fourth on it too so it's... almost done got a little bit of mixing down to do but pretty much there should be up and done in the next few days and let me know in the comments what your thoughts are or if there's any type of video you want me to do in future i'm sort of focusing on doing these lo-fi beats but this ain't all i do and producing isn't all i do either but uh, more to come in terms of me making beats and stuff and feel free if there's any input you want to give me regarding any of that uh, check me out on Beat Stars if you're a rapper or a singer and want to get any beats. Check out my music on Spotify under Lord Lav. Check out my website www.lordlav.com and make sure you like this video if you enjoyed it and make sure you subscribe as well so you can keep in the loop because I'm putting up these videos at least once a week at the moment and going to keep trying to do it as consistently as possible. So more to come. Stay safe, take it easy, and uh, peace. <music>